So I was finally lucky enough to unlock Unstable Overclock Sticky Fuel for the Driller's Flamethrower. There is actually another overclock that is essentially a lesser version of Sticky Fuel, so I really don't understand the purpose of this clean overclock. They could have done an entirely different overclock instead. But anyways, let's talk about Sticky Fuel Overclock. Now before we start, we need to understand what is Sticky Flame, because it can be confusing. So this Praetorian right here is just on fire, that is not Sticky Flame on him. Sticky Flame is the flame that burns on the terrain after you shoot on it. So without any mods or an overclock, it will only last 2 seconds. That being said, Sticky Flame will be your main focus with this overclock. So let's talk about the mods. For the first row, both overclocks are good. Range is probably more beneficial, but if you're playing on something like Hazard 5, you probably want to take more magazine capacity, as reloading can really get you killed if you get swarmed. For the second row of upgrades, let's start with Triple Filtered Fuel mod. This mod only affects the heat on direct damage. So, sadly, it will have no benefit for your sticky flame. So you are left with extra damage or sticky fuel duration mods, which both are great options. For the third row of upgrades, rate of fire is an awful option compared to the other two. So it's either extra ammo or sticky flame slowdown mod, which I think is great for this overclock. It will make enemies 55% slower, which has two benefits. Enemies will have a hard time getting to you and most importantly, they will stay longer in the sticky flame, meaning more DPS. For the fourth row of upgrades, let's start with It Burns mod, which sadly doesn't work with this overclock. Fear will only trigger from direct damage, it will not trigger from sticky flame. So you will have to go with either more ammo or sticky flame duration, which both are great options as well. And for the last row, let me start with target explode mod. Unfortunately, this mod will only trigger the explosion when enemies are killed from direct damage. So it's a bad option for this overclock. It doesn't work with the sticky flame. On the other hand, the heat radiance mod is a great mod. Not only that it heats enemies in a 5 meter radius, it also deals 80 fire damage after 1 second of constant fire. So you can see this is a very versatile overclock, with many options on the mods to play around with. It also adds a unique playstyle as you will shoot a lot more on the terrain instead of the enemies. This overclock is great and a lot of fun, but before you try this there are a few negative aspects with this overclock. It is horrible against Mokhtera enemies. Even if the enemy is close to the ground, Sticky Flame will not reach them. So the only way for Sticky Flame to deal damage to Mokhtera enemies is in tight tunnels. Another thing is Dreadnoughts. Sticky Flame slowdown doesn't work on them. They also have insane resistance to fire, so fire element will not trigger with this overclock. And Sticky Flame deals barely any damage to them. So you're better off using other guns. And it's very bad against Betsy. The Sticky Flame won't reach her weak spots and it will not slow her down. Now on the positive side, Sticky Flame won't deal you any damage. In fact, it doesn't deal any damage to your teammates as well. It is also a great way to deal with the swarmer nests. You won't even get to see them spawn. This might not be very useful, but Sticky Flame will deal damage to Spitball if you spray next to him. Also, if you have a scout who's running Cryo Minilets on his SMGs, they will pair really well with your Sticky Flame with that extra elemental damage. 
and the ice element will not affect their sticky flames, they will continue to burn as normal. At first I thought this is just a fun overclock for lower difficulties, but I will leave you with some footage from Hazard 5 mission with shield disruption. This overclock is actually very strong so I definitely recommend you try this out. Thank you for watching and if you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, a like or even a subscription would help me out a ton. Dropping experience. I'll never get the smell out of my arm. Ah. Much better. The toy is not ready. Sorry, your own fault for being full of goodies. More beasties incoming. Take care of what is left, then have a breather. Thank <laughs> you.